Hi, hello, ladies and gentlemen. And it's, it's my pleasure to deliver a speech on our beloved NCCU Toastmaster anniversary. And last week, our VPPR Amy asked me to do her assignment about Actually, he, she has a class, and she wants to do an interview with a successful people. <laughs> <laughs> and I think he choo she chose me as an interviewee. So, in one of her questions, she said, Do you have any suggestion for the college student to become more competitive? And I think this is a very good question. So I think all the I, I want to share my experience to all the postmaster and and that that that's the our topic come my topic come from. So but first I guess you 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 guys may think who on earth is this guy? He, he doesn't uh, look like competitive and don't even uh, so he didn't <laughs> he didn't look like competitive enough so why should I listen to him so I think I should tell you guys about my background so you guys may try to think about it later so actually I'm somewhat competitive. So actually I graduated from Zhao Tong University in Electrical Engineering, Zhao Da Dian Ji. And after graduate from the school, I attend, I got a admission from Columbia University in New York City. And New York City is good and I finally finished my master degree and I also got a job in California, so which is so called uh, a Silicon Valley, and I I think I worked there for a while, and I think I really like Taiwan, so I just quit my job and moved back to Taiwan, and when I was in California, I was a circuit design engineer. And when I back to Taiwan, I suddenly changed my mind and I want to become a software developer engineer. So I self-study for a few months and after several interviews, I finally become a software developer engineer. So that's what I plan. I do before and I think I am somewhat competitive so maybe you can uh, listen to my advice later <laughs> so first I think the most uh, I think one of the one of things for college students to become competitive is let's see. First, okay. First is what find what you really love and keep trying. So I think as a college student, the most luxurious thing you guys have is you have you can go to whatever class and you can just go there and listen to the professor so if you like the class then you will find what you love but if you don't like it you will just go to another department and try to listen to what the professor says so if you keep trying it is very easy to find what you love later so uh, since I graduate, I think this is uh, for uh, people who start working, it is impossible to 
cut this kind of chance. So, as a student, I really hope you guys can listen as more class and make friends with a lot of other departments. And that will open your view. And if you are almost graduate, so don't worry. So if you think, oh, I'm already graduate, I don't have any chance to listen to other major. So don't worry. I prepared the second advice. So the second advice is be persistent and embrace the failure. So actually, if you want to learn something and very good at something, it is very easy to give up and and just give up and didn't try again. So my advice is if you really love or you have you don't really hate it, so just try it and try several times and you will definitely feel adequate about it. And and to become competitive, the most important thing is you know something really well. So if you don't if you cannot be persistent, you can it is you cannot uh, understand things very well. So like in our interview. So our uh, so as a software developer engineer, our interviews are always very difficult, and you know you really need to do a lot of the, uh, in the, you need to do a lot of research. So if you don't have persistence, it is not easy to become successful. And. I think I use all, all of my time, but if you want to know the four and three and four point of my my dog, you can count up in later. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks uh, thank for listening.